Hi, I'm doing a quick little film here of how to set up 2D and 3D front full dome content from Mobile VR Station 1.3. So the first thing you do is you need to just get the content into the app. I would suggest using a computer, download the videos that you want to your local hard drive, and then open up iTunes and use the sharing options to actually you know drag the movie files into the application. And then that's how I'm going to demonstrate showing it now. Assume I've already moved the files into the app. Now what I need to do is I'm going to now go down to Content Browser. So I'm going to tap on that. And now it's going to give me a couple different options. I have Drives, that's files on this physical device. I can also go to My Media, that's on my camera roll, videos, pictures, panoramas, everything there. And then if I have a file server, I can put all my big files on a UPnP server. Right now I'm going to click on Drives. And right now, my file that I want to play is inside my documents. Tap that. All right, and now I'm going to play this one right here. But before I do anything, I need to set it up. So I'm going to go Edit. And then what I want to do is, this says Playback Type here. I want to make sure that I chose for my film, I'm going to say 2D Front Full Dome. But then if this was a 3D movie, I would choose 3D Front Full Dome Side by Side, which is right underneath the 2D Front Full Dome. So right now, I'm just going to tap on 2D. All right, I'm going to tap on save. And then also then, like, if you just brought in a new file, it won't have a thumbnail. So you can tap on the information I over here and then say generate icon. And then it's going to give you a couple options of, you know, which thumbnail would you like to use. Just tap on one. All right, and now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to tap on the file. And I can tap the screen to skip this. Oh, and now you see it's playing my homemade fisheye content, which is actually a basically full dome, which now I'm going to now stare at the eyeball, make the screen disappear, so I don't have to worry about it anymore, and then I can look around and see how my content is. All right, thank you.